diamonds, no filter. No. When 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 Rockefeller was the most powerful label at one point, um, one of the most powerful labels. All right. When was it over? Like like, cause I always like, was it a, a moment? No no. When when did you realize, yo, this shit is over, man? Like I think I think once the spoof came out, I think when Death of the Dynasty came okay. out, it was like, all right, this is borderline, you know, Some almost, real shit, real right? Shit. It's <laughs> like. They ain't cashing out for nothing, you know what I'm saying? They yeah. ain't pushing this out for nothing. And I, and I wasn't a fool to read that. I could read that. We uh, we switched from different studios and left our home studios and went to different studios. It was like, ah, uh, something ain't right. This internal, though, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, but yeah. But you just weren't prepared for, for, the, for, the, for, the, for the ship to sink, you know? You just weren't prepared for it. You just weren't prepared because you didn't understand, you know? We ain't hit no uh, iceberg. Was it like <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Was it, it, yeah. <laughs> was it like parents divorcing and you had to choose who you wanted to be with? What? Yeah, t- like sim- yeah, actually, yeah, actually, that be honest, yeah. So, and where did where did you choose to stay with? I didn't choose. It was just like I had to go with Dame, but Dame never had no. Pop- he didn't have a distribution at the oh, time. Oh shit! You, you know, had Dame, to go with Dame. Yeah, you know, Dame was like, you know, Dame was Dame. He was a real aggressive business dude. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. So, so you know, that's where I ended up at, and you know, that's what it was. So, um, at at this at this point right now, when Dame Dash, you go with Dame Dash, uh-huh. and then I think he had the Dame Dash Music Group, and I did think, think they did put Beanie Siegel out album out, I right? Think, did Beanie put another album out? Yeah, the beat, the beat, the beat coming was out on Dame Dash Music Group, if I'm not mistaken. Actually, that's tells of us the two, right? Yeah, because he went to jail. He went to jail right, yeah, and he right. put so, out. Okay, the, yeah. Cool, yeah. So that's, that's like one of yeah. my favorite Beanie albums. So he did get another album out. Yeah, yeah, he went, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, so yeah. he did, yeah, and. So, because what I'm trying to get the fans to understand is that you on the powerful label. Right. The label breaks up. Jay-Z goes this way. I think Crack stayed with Jay-Z. Um, PD, PD Free, and I think the Young Guns. Yeah, they stayed with Jay-Z. Right. It was PD Freeway and the Young Guns. They and stayed. then y'all go with Dame, but then there is no right. Dame. So, yeah. so what does Emilio do from there? Like, like... Like you don't have a record deal no more. Well, Emilio go home. Yeah, <laughs> and take a break. It was a yeah, fresh. Yeah, it was yeah, a breath yeah. of fresh. No, it was just like it was. It was. It was a break. You know, I, I felt like I was grinding from from two. I was grinding from ninety nine to two thousand eight. I was in. I was in need of that break. You know what I'm saying? So some things ain't always horrible. As it, it seems to most people. Like for me, it was a good thing. It was a relief. Right. Right. So it's like I, I got. I got to do some independence. Uh, I, I got. I gained some independence. And did some independent uh, things and and pushed and saw uh, seeing things different as a business per- a man and and that's what it was. I got time to go see things and vacate on my own outside the group. I didn't got to worry about who's who and what's why. I had to deal with none of that. I was on my own, standing on my own two feet and pushing. So if Jay Z call you right now and say, "Come fuck with this Rock Nation shit." Well, we, I know how to negotiate now too. So I was saying, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so that's his table, right? Yeah, yeah, right, yeah, we yeah. at the round table. Like, you know, like a lot of that stuff, like a lot of that being raised, everybody say, uh, everybody asks me if Jay called or what, what would happen. You know, it's like, like I said, I ain't got time for, I ain't got no bad blood. You know, it is what it is. People that know the story, you know the story. I ain't going to waste my breath on it. It, it. When he ready to talk, he ready to talk, but I don't know if he's going to call or not. So that's why I'm building what I'm building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, facts. I, You're not sitting there dormant. I'm not waiting for Jay. I can't, yeah, yeah, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not waiting for him. So when y'all do do the little spot dates in the shows, how do he get in contact with you? Does this like a random number call you and stuff? For who? For you. Like, well, when, I, you know what's crazy about that? I'm quite sure him being who he is, if he wanted to find me, he could find me. Yeah, he'll find you right now while we sitting there talking. <laughs> he could, right. If he wanted to find me, he could find me. Right. So, so if he wanted to holler, he, you know, he could holler. But in the meanwhile... You know, I got to grind, so yeah. if, if he can find me, then you see I'm grinding. So, you know what I'm saying? Y'all did the, the, the B-side show, right? right? Mm-hmm. Um, and you was definitely, y'all, it was like a... a I, didn't, I never made, see, that's that's another thing. That's another thing. So, if you're, every when people talk to me about what they see, why they don't see that Sparks ain't in these, in these arenas with them? They not calling Sparks, so... With that being said, I don't get into the bitterness. You know, okay. probably behind closed doors, if somebody bring it up, or I might say... All right, I feel some type of way about it, but it's like oh, I gotta forgive him to a certain extent because I ain't got time. Yeah, and, and he not around me no more. You know, I was emotionally tied to it when I was around him. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, that's the past. You know what I'm saying? It's a history because it's Esther Stone. It was a dynasty that could have went further, way further than or you know, with us, with us, it could have went somewhere. But I'm, you know, what I'm supposed to do. Doggy 
diamonds, no filter.